the social media summit which examined the issues for the youth in South Asia and how various social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, etc. have been used to build campaigns and causes uh, for promoting transparency, things which the youth care about. Uh, we, In our panel, we had various practitioners who have actually built real-life campaigns around real-life problems. So we had alternative which talked about how they use social media to build engagement, to solve a real problem around waste management and how do you sort of then engage various local authorities to make sure that they were doing the kind of things that they were supposed to do to make sure that there was no garbage, no uh, landfills which went unattended in the city of Bangalore. Similarly, we had uh, the director from Change.org who talked about their campaign and how they partnered with various NGOs and grassroots groups in terms of doing list building for saving that Save the RTI campaign, uh, which basically ensured, I mean, all that public momentum and all that engagement on internet and various social media platforms, then eventually ensured that there was support on that from various parliamentarians. And then that particular amendment proposal went back to a standing committee for a re-examination. So these were some of the examples we talked about. We also had Swaniti which talked about how do you use the internet and social media and their fellowship program to build dialogue with institutions. Uh, this is a very unique mechanism where it is providing an avenue for common people to engage with their elected officials directly and also for the elected officials to establish a dialogue uh, and to create policy instead of having an presumptive or a presumptive model of what people want. A very interesting point which was also raised by the various panelists was that this new technology is actually provide a forum for the citizens to be more informed, more informed about their choices and more informed in terms of how do they engage with their elected officials and their leaders and therefore make that a more dynamic process than just uh, episodic once in a five year event during elections. That was one of my main takeaways from the meeting today. And I'm very happy, I'm glad to be here and I thank the organizers for uh, pulling this together.